What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We just sold out 2023 Topps Chrome Jumbo 8-box case break. Pick team's number 19. And again, guys, all cards ship. And let's get to breaking this, guys. So, uh, Alfred got last spot mojo, Red Sox. There you go. Second, guys, let me go get a knife. Yes, Pete, if your shipping address is wrong, uh, definitely has, uh, Duncan said, email us. We have a support button on the website or uh, email support at jaspies.com, but the support button's a little easier. Uh, you just, uh, like I said, hit that button and just say, hey, uh, I just noticed my shipping address is wrong. Um, here's the right address, and then we can manually change that for you. But in your account for future, obviously, uh, purchases you can obviously change that now that you notice it and don't have to worry about that in the future So I'll rip four boxes at a time, guys, and then we'll go through the hits and then rip the next four. Oh, and then, like, uh, there's a one... I mean, I can't... Oh. I don't have a password. I mean, I guess you can do it in the background if you want to, like, pull it up over here. It's up to you. Maybe send that to yourself. Oh, oh even better. <laughs> um, I don't think so. I think we have plenty. So I'm pretty sure we can upload more. Yeah, no, it's great. I mean, we've we've all loved Topps Chrome ripping it. So they said I could open this without screwing up the screen, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm.
Yeah, I'll post another one up after this. So like I said, I, I, Top's Chrome crowd has always been a little different from like NT. Not to say that there aren't people that buy into both, but Top Chrome obviously a lot different price point too as well. So I don't think it hurts like other breaks on the website. So you know, definitely want to focus on doing some other stuff that's close. But obviously, we can always do a Top Chrome every day. You know. Like say a case of NT a day keeps the doctor away. Same thing with Top Chrome. Take your Top Chrome vitamins daily. Good for you. Yeah, they're good for you, right? You just have to go to like the shipping and, and orders and then look for that day that it's called. And then it should be right there and then just kind of like control F the break that you're looking for. No problem. Yeah, I mean, obviously, there's still plenty of time. It's not like this is going to get sorted out right after the break and get shipped out, you know? Like, it's still going to take a few days to sort it out, you know, sort out other breaks, of course, from the same days or previous days, and then ship it out. So, we try to tell people it takes usually three business days to about five if we're, like, super backed up, which obviously with all this Topps Chrome and... Oh, super... Well, I mean, if it wasn't that far long ago, I think you'll be fine. But, yeah, good thing you sent that now. I'm not sure. We do have a shipping tab on the website or on our little uh, Google Docs. So you can see if it actually has been sorted or shipped out yet. But if it was just like a couple of days ago, I think you'll be fine. But, yeah, I always just double check that because, of course, I mean, sometimes it's out of our control, right, if the address is wrong or stuff like that. So... As long as you guys can catch it beforehand, we can always, uh... With this camera job, I think we have to, like, uh... It's like the old one, right? Where we have to kind of, like, uh... Re-focus uh, it or yeah. that... Yeah, I think the focus is kind of set, but you can change it to whatever is comfortable oh, okay. for your hands. Gotcha. Where you want to place your hands. Oh, yeah, usually... I had it, like, at 50 or 60. Yeah, so usually, like, right there. Should be fine. Yeah, because it was set to 30. Hold on guys, let me pretend I'm gonna hold this card here. Yeah, that looks good. Awesome. Nice, yeah, well, I, I, everybody's customer service is a little different when it comes to like, yeah, the bigger companies like that, but I feel like a lot of people have appreciated the tops one. Stephonic. And not, not to, you know, put down any other ones, but obviously, like, I feel like with Panini, obviously, they've, they're the ones that have, like, the multiple sports right now and stuff like that, licensing, so obviously it seems like they might be getting a lot more, more, uh, more volume of stuff sold and ripped. So obviously with that, oh, sh the hell, hold on, I think that was the wrong one. Whoa, whoa, what's going on here? Oh, 
I wasn't. <laughs> hey, Joe, can you help me really quick? I wasn't paying attention to which one I was moving right now. But this is right, but what did I do to make it like super, super light like that? Oh, um, go to camera control and go to exposure. Is that the one I probably moved? Oh, that. it went back to normal settings. And then maybe? go oh, one way or the other. Okay. So probably like minus one. six, and then you can change brightness on the first tab. So I don't know why it changed. It was just fine right now. Put it up just a little bit. Okay. Yeah, I just don't know which one I moved because it just all of a sudden got like super, super white. I thought I was moving the focus, but I might have been might moving have been more. exposure. Yeah. And then you can go to the first tab again, and sharpness is all the way to the right, right? Okay, yeah. Yeah, okay. Well, it is what it is, guys, I guess. I think this looks good. You just want to make your cards look good. Yeah, I know. I was just like, <laughs> I thought I was moving the focus, and I was like, I think I moved the other one. All right, here we go, guys. Let's keep it going. And what do we got here? Christian Yelich? Nice. Orange out of 25. Montreal, Austin A's. Oh, nice, yeah. For sure, yeah. I feel like everyone's has a different experience, too. I did read somewhere, though, that uh, Tops obviously, with Fanatics, is trying to make it, uh, make it where, uh, I think, by, like, 2024, get reading, getting rid of Redemptions. You know, that's something I think they said, like Michael Rubin and a lot of them have trying to focus on where get everybody's cards on card or even with a sticker, right? Just ready to roll before even the product is released, which would be freaking awesome. Peraza. So I get it, though. Like, I've, I've never been one to complain about Redemption so much because obviously sometimes it's life's busy for some of these athletes. But I mean, obviously, <laughs> if they're obligated to sign, then you know, they kind of have to. But... Yeah, if they can get it all done beforehand, and that's that'd be amazing. And also, too, I think they were trying to say that it brings the value up of older boxes too in the future, right? So let's just say, you know, mm. no more expired. Right? Yeah, exactly. Let's just say, you know, Wonder Frank goes to redemption, and 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 uh, you know, in 2022, right? You open that up a few years later, right? They might not even have that card anymore. They can't even honor it. 20 years later, we get the Hall of Famer. Yeah. So for 10 times the price. Yeah. So, so now, obviously, yeah, in the future, when there's like a future Hall of Famer, you're like, oh man, I'm gonna go buy 2025 because we know that dude's live, right? And it makes the box value up, bring go up even more. Gian Carlos Stanton. Yeah, and like I said, I, I'm not one to complain so much of redemptions, but if you can get rid of them, which screens and actually come and do this manual? Is it, is that into the other screen? No. It should though, isn't it wireless? It could be wireless, I don't know. Could be wireless. Caleb that. killing. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> is that a Jesus shop Yeah, that's a tech guy right there. Yeah, Jesus is good guy. Wanna get me a, a monster box? Do you have pal? Yeah, I never got that actually. I hate that like I hate that when you reward when you use uh, sorry, when you uh, redeem points on the rewards website, you have to pay for shipping. Like what is that? But you don't pay for shipping though when they couldn't get you that redemption though, right? Well, at that point then, just put the hit in the box for me then, so I don't even have to deal with this. Right? Alex Call. So you're gonna have to use these monster boxes? We have to, give me like 20 of those. <laughs> Tati's to 2.89. What's that? I took it out of this. Yeah, that's fine.
13 though. I, I haven't used any of my rewards in years. I have like, I think I have like 30, 3,400 points in my Panini rewards and I, I haven't used it in years, but that's wild. Stowers. And Michael Massey to 199. CJ Stroud threw an interception. That's it, it's over for him. <laughs> Those preseason games? Yeah, there's actually only two today, it looks like. Woo! Bo Jackson! Ultraviolet, that's a green. That's very nice. And uh, out of 99, 49 out of 99. That's pretty sweet. Last time I redeemed points. Oof! Drew Locke. I totally believed in that guy at one point. I met that dude at the rookie premiere back in 2016, I think it was, 2017, whatever year it was. And, or no, not 20, that's way too early. That was, uh, that was the other Broncos quarterback. I met him at the 2019, I think, right? He was 2019. Oh, really? I'm doing so much better seeing your chat in this uh, stream now, Rex. You just always make my day. Can't wait to come into work and say, when is Rex going to chat with me? Out of 150, Cody Thomas. Cody Bellinger. Giancarlo. The thrill. It's like, what is Rex going to talk to me about today? And what am I going to be able to pick on Rex today with, you know? It's just, it's the thrill of the day. Cody Bellinger, look at that. Keep him in Chicago, right, Rex? Out of 125. Suri Ruiz. Marcus Simeon, negative. For how, what, what was the, what's the years though? I think that's the most important part. Curtin Walker Refractor.
Yeah, because I don't think he's going to get more than like 20, 25 a year, right? So that seems more like a 5 to 7 for like 100 plus. More like in the 15 million range or so. Nelson Velasquez. Max Mayer to 250. Was it that just only Cubs? But a little Adley Rutschman to 499 refractor. No, man, but the, the Cubs are one of the few teams like the Athletics, the Reds, the A's that just have massive like rookies in their checklist. Where like they have five to seven. And uh, they tend to kind of get most of the autos. I mean, obviously, they're not going to be handing out like Adley Rutschmans in every case, but they'll filter in the other guys, of course. But there's still time, man. We still have half the case left. Corbin Carroll refractor. Nick Castellanos. And Will Brennan. Major <laughs> cuts his wings. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely always a wall to chuck. I feel like I always hit an Aaron Ashby at some point. I feel like a Stewie Ruiz pops out a lot too. There's, there's quite a few players you almost see in every case. Brett Beatty. I'm a little Josh Young. Josh Young, right? I think everyone says it's supposed to be pronounced Young. Nice Adley in this first half. And a ton of other nice cards here, a ton of colors. Remember, A's tend to pop up a lot, guys. I personally feel like I've been hitting a lot of Adley Rutschmans of lately, too. Um, and especially for Aaron Billingsley, who's a big Baltimore guy. I feel like I've gotten quite a few Adleys already. And then I did hit that Adley. Um, Gunnar Henderson Super Fractor last week, so I feel like a lot of our cases have had a lot of Orioles. Don't get me wrong, though, we've hit like a lot of Corbin Carrolls in that, too. Uh, I did a, We did a four-case uh, jumbo, or sorry, four-case hobby break on Fanatics Live on Tuesday, me and Michael. And for one of our customers that also shops here at Big Dog, he got an orange wave out of 25 Corbin Carroll autograph. Uh, a variation and then Michael when he ripped I ripped the orange one and then when Michael was ripping the second half of the case we did two each he got a Corbin Carroll like aqua teal Corbin Carroll at the same time and one of the other cases so yeah I feel like we've been getting a lot of the top players but I want to say I've been hitting a lot more Adley than anything just wish that super factor was live you know I really wanted to hit that one live I had like five one ones out of NT yesterday, guys. I was super hot with NT. So let's, let's get some more NT rolling, guys. 
We're just down to the random number block. And they're not as pricey as the ones that were up yesterday for the first couple bigger teams. And I feel like for the teams remaining in each one of them, they're pretty solid value. We did about like three cases yesterday on the Fanatics Live app. And uh, plenty of really, really nice hits, guys. Plenty. Last box here, guys. You see me grabbing right there from the top camera, the pack shift to my right. So yeah, guys, uh, it looks like uh, somebody sold out that pack filler for the Big Hit Express. So uh, we'll be doing that momentarily after this. We'll upload another Big Hit Express filler. And let's, might as well knock off the uh, Tops, or the uh, Tops Chrome Jumbo Pack break. That unlocks and gives away uh, nine spots in the uh, Hip Parade dual case for the baseball. And again, let's continue to move those RMBs, guys. Eight left and nine left. I mean, if those be sitting there for a few hours today, guys, I wouldn't doubt it if Nick hasn't already thought of it or planned to obviously create some little pack fillers or box breaks to create a mini filler for the RMB if that needs to, if that helps itself faster. So I feel like the teams in there are pretty solid and for the price point, it's not as pricey as the other ones. So we can definitely get some done, guys. Aranda for the raise. Darling Marte for the Mets. Josh Smith for the Texas Rangers. Let's go into Tristan. All 
Alright, we got Salvador Perez, a little relic of the Kansas City Royals. It's going to John. JT Realmuto, nice gold wave to 50. And Espinosa for the Padres. Three more boxes to go. Ready, Furman. Royals. Joe Musgrove, a little negative. MJ Melendez to three ninety nine. We have uh, Bryce Johnson for the Giants. Jordan Walker, Fractor. Xbox. Michael Tobalea for the Colorado Rockies. Luis Arias to three ninety nine for the Marlins. Owen Gorman. Another Bryce Johnson. Come on, man. Give me something nice. Emma, though, is very happy. There you go. Rafael Devers for the Red Sox, 52 out of 75. Colin Gorman, oh. and then Bryce Terang for Milwaukee.
All right, last box mojo, guys. Good luck, everybody. So, yeah, I'll upload another one if it hasn't been uploaded just yet. I'm, I think we do have enough to do a couple, so. Josh Smith for the Texas Rangers. Brett Beatty. Mookie. Bo Naylor for the Cleveland Guardians. Ryan Boone. Palacios. I got two base colors, two base autos. I feel like the next one should be a nice color. Ooh, nice Freddie Freeman there for the Dodgers. Remember, there's that's not set in stone right now. Who's gonna win MVP from the NL? It might be this guy right here. This guy's having an incredible season. And in the buyback program, that could be a hundred bucks. I should have one more auto in here somewhere. Oh man, it's gonna be another base. Mark Vientos for the Mets. Howard though, there you go. All right, the last second on the board. All right, well, it seems like we just got one bigger, bigger name with the Adley and the case hit ultraviolets. Good colors, but not the, the craziest rookies. But a lot of colors going out to a lot of teams, at least. And then obviously, quick recap, we'll top load all these. A lot of base autos, I feel like, in this one. That was one refractor, a couple repeats. There's a relic. Brennan. Waldachuk, Thomas, Massey. Peraza, I guess there was a Peraza in there. It's Walt Peraza. Then you had, of course, the Stefanik and the Adley and the case hit there. I guess it was like eight colors, but always want more. So appreciate it, folks. Uh, like I said, uh, we'll post up another one, but let's try to get some other breaks going, especially the NT RMB that helps sell out Pikachu number three, guys. Appreciate it, folks. Jaspiescasebreaks.com